So here are some of the most common causes of cholesterol imbalance in the body. Number one is an inflammatory diet. So if someone is consuming a lot of polyunsaturated fatty acids that can be very inflammatory, not only to the artery walls, but for the entire body, this can be a causative factor in terms of cholesterol levels being out of whack. As well as lack of exercise. So somebody who is more sedentary may have an imbalance in their cholesterol levels and this could be related to weight gain as well now number three is stress so we know that stress can definitely have an impact on our cholesterol levels and can be related to that imbalance number four is insulin resistance so we know that when our blood glucose levels aren't properly balanced this can translate into cholesterol being out of balance as well so that's something to definitely address and take a look at the causative factors as to why your insulin or your blood glucose levels are not balanced. Lack of sunlight. So we know that our cholesterol breakdown in terms of being able to produce our vitamin D can be related to our cholesterol levels as well. So that lack of natural sunlight and sunshine and the ability to make our vitamin D is very much related to our cholesterol as well. Number six is EMF. So the non-native electromagnetic fields that have a negative impact on our cellular health and our mitochondrial health can be related to imbalances in cholesterol levels as well. Now in this study, it was found that the effects of electromagnetic fields on serum lipids in workers of a power plant and chronic EMF exposure was associated with the change of serum lipid levels. So this has definitely been researched, something to definitely be aware of, and that's why I have other videos all about how to decrease your EMF exposure in your environment and why that's so important for your overall health and for longevity as well. So please check those out. Number seven is liver toxicity. So we know that for proper cholesterol production in the liver and breakdown and recycling and detoxification, we need to have a healthy liver function. And that's why I'm all about doing regular detoxification for the liver, but for the other internal organs as well. If you want, you know, some more information on how to do that safely and effectively with some herbal medicines, please check out the links below. And number eight is low thyroid. So anybody who has a low thyroid, you may have been told by your doctor in terms of your blood work that your cholesterol levels are a little bit high and that's very common. Now when we have low thyroid hormones, then the liver can't really process the cholesterol that it needs as effectively and the body doesn't break down and remove that LDL, so the low density lipoprotein as efficiently and therefore we could have higher LDL levels. So this is something definitely to be aware of. And that active T3, so that active thyroid hormone, helps to sensitize that LDL receptor on the membranes of cells so that it can actually do what it needs to do in terms of thyroid hormone, but are the LDL as well. So when we do have low T3 levels, this can result in a form of LDL resistance. So similar to insulin resistance or leptin resistance, now it could be an LDL resistance problem and that is, again, running the risks of more cardiovascular disease, especially the, that plaque formation in the arteries because of the LDL. So something to be aware of, getting the thyroid imbalance, the leptin signaling imbalance is important, as well as making sure that we're preventing that LDL resistance. So today I talked all about some of the causes of a cholesterol imbalance. And again, it's not just about having high or low cholesterol, it's about finding that balance. I hope that you do have some questions or comments for me and please put them in the comments section below. Be sure to share this video as well. If you did learn something new, I'd love to see a big thumbs up. And of course, if you love this video as well, I appreciate all of your support. If you're new to my channel, welcome in. Please subscribe and click that bell to turn on the notifications. Everyone has a calling in life and mine is to empower you to live a healthy lifestyle and of course, to do it naturally. Thanks for watching.